One East Texas community are fighting against plans to build a solar energy farm. KLTV's Willie Downs reports from the Franklin County Commissioner's Court. They want a moratorium reinstated to prevent the project. No, no, no. During a heated Franklin County Commissioner's Court meeting this morning, the community gathered to voice concerns over industrial solar farms coming to the county to build and expand on up to 30,000 acres of land. Yeah. County Judge Scott Lee says the county attorney in legal representation for the state said they do not have the authority to mandate a moratorium which would temporarily prevent the construction. We have to follow our attorney's advice. <clears throat> And if we don't follow our attorney's advice, we're no longer under the umbrella of lawsuits, personally, because we went against that. Judge Lee says while he does not personally agree with building the solar farms, the county has to stay within their legal boundaries. Ronnie Barker has lived in Franklin County his entire life. He believes the county's greater legal responsibility is to protect public health. And it says the governing body of a municipality or commissioner's court of a county may enforce any law that is reasonably necessary to protect the public health. And that's what we're asking them to do. And they're scared to do it because they've been spooked so much about uh, getting sued. Those in the community are concerned about the negative impact they say the solar farms will have on the county, including environmental impacts, property values, and fire hazards, among others. Willie Downs, KLTV 7 News. Representatives from the Stockyard Solar Project were not at the meeting. County Judge Lee says he's having the state attorney general offer a third opinion on whether they can reinstate the rescinded moratorium.